Welcome to Wessie's Channel, this is Wessie and it is Wessie's News. Дорогие друзья, это мой подарок русскому царю с Днем Победы, 9 мая. Это также моя отповедь за кадрами. Today I'm going to introduce you the missing link in whole technology of Dr. James Corum, but also Nikola Tesla, who couldn't understand what he had in his hands in 1901. This is a crucial moment in understanding of energy transfer and energy extraction and this publication is done with due respect to great American scientist Dr. James Corum and Kenneth Corum, his brother. Dr. Corum and Visit is interested with making money and there is nothing wrong with that. However, we as Americans were interested with getting something for nothing, that means electrical energy for free. I was thinking, should I patent this missing link? Well, it opens whole array of possible application. The temptation was there. Fame, money, offers. That is what everybody wants, right? From the other hand, Russia and its special spy forces are only waiting for the chance to get an advantage of an American science for their own use that is not always friendly from our perspective. So, since I'm not Dr. Corum, having unlimited financial support, to make 200 plus patents, I can only patent one particular application at a time and the rest is unprotected. I assume that Dr. Corum purposely didn't want this part to be understood properly, including visit investors. And uh, that was a big mistake. The information that is in public domain cannot be patented and anyone with an application using such information cannot reserve it to himself. There will be always this video and set of the information published by me that could leverage somebody's action. So it is now yours. The material is released for the benefit of every American, European and even Russian. Some Russian. According to OK given to me by my friend Dr. Hans. This introduction is not going to be easily understood by average viewer but even professionals will have plenty of brainstorm questions there, not going to move only inside of the brackets created by kindness of Dr. Haas, but the most of the confusion will be at field of TM and TM mode versus proposed application, that means transverse electromagnetic wave in transverse magnetic mode. I'm not going to explain to you everything till I get final approval from Dr. Haas, but at least I will protect his part of science from being stolen or reserved by others, especially some Russians. Dr. Gorm was dancing around phasing coils as good as he could and he didn't sufficiently explain in his patent the mechanism of pinpoint directed energy in form of electromagnetic waves at desired angle. That possibly created a lot of criticism by very well respected blogger EEV blog. This guy. Free energy bullshit. Hi. Yes, it's free energy time. Oh goodness, normally I wouldn't touch these things. You've no doubt seen all these videos on YouTube of people, they've built up a circuit, a machine, whatever, and they're claiming free energy. We have a problem of understanding. Free energy has nothing to do with over immunity. Free energy is just the energy that doesn't have to be paid for. You don't pay for wind energy and you don't pay for water flow and you don't pay for sun energy. You just pay for the device that is used for it. So if somebody finds another way of getting energy for free, what problem do you have? Sir. So free energy, maybe it's your bullshit, but it's not mine. And it's not bullshit of the dreams of plenty of other guys. While the Earth continually absorbs solar radiation, it will not... wants to add to the experience. It pushes the young brains to educate themselves. And you just slash, utilize the emission of long wave radiation cools and defecate <laughs> on somebody willing to understand. What is this all about? Where did this all come from? The why. The why. The why, 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 why. Are you ready? All right. Here we go. Hard as I can. Wow. Wow. A thing of beauty is a joy forever. Look at that. Shoe. Oh, goodness. Look at that. The steel toe shoe. Uh, 
closed in on his, wow, wow. Scientific theories are not opinions or superficial observations. They are much more. In science, a theory is defined as a well-substantiated explanation of some aspect of the natural world based on a body of facts that have repeatedly been confirmed through observation and experimentation. At Hug Day Forum, this one, we have Texas Tesla Tower subject that is being discussed. And we have a gentleman named Mark, February 13, 2020. And this guy complained that he wasn't treated the same way as members of EEV blog, presumably, on that forum. So at Hug Day Forum, Mark made a quite nice explanation. But he was bullied by presumably members of EEV blog having remarkable freedom of expressing their opinion on that forum. And that opinion wasn't scientific and wasn't having too much value. At the same time, Mark was scrutinized, his posts have been altered and mixed into unreadable gibberish. Yes, uh, Michael Anderson had no problem to publicly defecate at our Western education system and scientific recognition, posting in broken English and good English. Depends who of his presumably Russian team members was writing the response at that given time. So for you, Michael Anderson, likely at EEV blog forum, there is an answer. PhD is a position, recognition, pension and career in USA. It's a value. But like Mark said in his comment addressed to owner of Oh, he disappeared. Wow. Owner of EEV platform. You are terminated. Quote. I have extremely good opinion about YouTube channel of EEV Block. And of course I have two. Excellent guy, excellent skills. Good professional. Yes. However, a good shoemaker is only a shoemaker. And nothing about that. He may express his opinion that lies outside of his field of expertise, but for Shoemaker, who is highly criticizing an area of science, well, he may not be as good at it as other physicists, including Dr. Quorum. And it is not only not elegant, but highly inappropriate. And I believe in Australia it is also not elegant, it is also inappropriate. End of quote. On EEV blog, my own activity at overunit.com is not mentioned at all. Fear of being questioned by members and moderators of my part of forum is making EEV blog with his high standing heads impotent. Well, money earned and popularity of EEV blog to YouTube will likely be damaged by that quite remarkably. We may assume that viewers of overunity.com and similar forums would be quite moved by EEV blog comments. Just demonstrate it. Right. Why, 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 why? Why? Why you? What makes you so special? And that's the difference. I don't make money. You, my friend, you make money, you care about your advertising, you care about your presentation. I do it for free. I don't make money. I don't charge anybody one single penny. And I have no reason to lie. Thank you. Let's go to the material.